Ever wonder why INFJs, the rarest personality type, can sometimes be hard to deal with? INFJs, or introverted intuitive feeling judging types, make up a mere 1% of the population. They're known for their empathy, intuition, and idealism. But like all of us, they're not without their flaws. These unique individuals have a cocktail of traits that can prove challenging for those around them. Dive in with us as we uncover seven toxic traits of the INFJ personality type. Trait 1. Overthinking. Ever feel like your INFJ friend is lost in their own world? That's because INFJs, with their intuitive and introspective nature, often find themselves spiraling into a labyrinth of their own thoughts. This tendency to overthink can create a whirlpool of unnecessary stress and anxiety. It's like being stuck in a maze with no exit in sight. So while introspection can lead to profound insights, it's also a double-edged sword. Remember, it's not always beneficial to get lost in one's thoughts. Trait 2. Perfectionism. Are INFJs too hard on themselves and others? Now, INFJs are known for their high standards. They meticulously strive for excellence in everything they do. However, these lofty benchmarks can sometimes morph into unrealistic expectations. It's like chasing a mirage, always out of reach, leading to a cycle of self-doubt and disappointment. This relentless pursuit of perfection can also spill over onto others, setting them up for failure too. While striving for excellence is commendable, expecting perfection can lead to disappointment. Trait 3. Being overly private. Is your INFJ friend a closed book? This personality type is known for being reserved, often keeping their thoughts and feelings to themselves. While this trait can be beneficial, giving them a sense of control and protection, it can also make it challenging for others to truly understand and connect with them. It's like trying to read a book with half the pages missing. Maintaining privacy is essential, but too much can lead to isolation. Trait 4. High Sensitivity. Do INFJs take things too personally? An INFJ's heightened sensitivity can sometimes make them vulnerable to taking comments or criticisms more personally than intended. This deep-feeling nature can lead to misunderstandings, causing unnecessary hurt and conflict. It's important to remember that sensitivity is a double-edged sword. It allows INFJs to empathize deeply with others, but it can also make them susceptible to emotional turbulence. Being sensitive is a strength, but too much can be a burden. Trait 5. Stubbornness. Ever find it hard to change an INFJ's mind? This is because they are often deeply rooted in their convictions. For them, their beliefs and principles aren't just opinions, they are a part of their identity. This strong sense of self can be admirable. However, it can also lead to a resistance to change, making them seem stubborn. They may reject differing perspectives and new ideas. Having strong beliefs is admirable, but being inflexible can hinder growth. Trait 6. Idealism. Are INFJs living in a dream world? It's a question worth asking. INFJs are known for their idealistic nature, often envisioning a world that aligns perfectly with their values. However, this can lead to disappointment when reality falls short of their expectations. They may find themselves continually chasing a dream that's just out of reach. Dreaming big is great, but one should not ignore the reality. Trait 7. Burnout. Do INFJs push themselves too hard? Indeed, INFJs are notoriously tenacious, often driven by a deep-seated need to make a difference. This relentless pursuit of helping others and bringing about change can, however, lead to exhaustion and even burnout. They pour so much of themselves into their passions and causes, sometimes neglecting their own needs in the process. It's important for INFJs to remember that being passionate is commendable, but remember to also take care of yourself. To summarize, the seven toxic traits we discussed are overthinking, perfectionism, being overly private, high sensitivity, stubbornness, idealism, and burnout. These traits, while common among INFJs, are not entirely negative. They can lead to deep introspection, high standards, and a strong sense of personal integrity. However, they can also cause strain in relationships and personal distress, if not managed well. It's crucial to understand these traits to build stronger, healthier connections with the INFJs in our lives. Remember, every personality type has its strengths and weaknesses. By understanding these traits, we can foster better relationships with the INFJs in our lives.